Hello and welcome back. Uh, if you are just joining me, my name is Hoon. My channel is all about making better coffee at home. So past years I've been using uh, Brista Express as my daily coffee machine and I just added the niche uh, coffee grinder as well. So I had a full review on that and also compare uh, comparison with my mother grinder on my channels too. So make sure to check it out as well. Uh, by the way, I'm going to shout out to Nelly. Uh, I know you're not I hope you are feeling better and we are thinking about you and take care okay uh, so today's video I'm going to show you guys how to uh, adjust this leveler okay also known as the I mean, distribution tool here so I've been using it for past a year or so I really love it actually I, this is really fantastic tool to have to just making a better uh, better shots so, so this is portal filter just simply once you pull the uh, once you got the coffee ground just just level out like this and then finish up with your temper and that's it but uh, about six months ago I was watching Mark from Hotel uh, Whole Lot of Love uh, he was using this I mean not this one but you know he uh, he was using much better leveler but uh, he got the, the depth of the leveler match with the, the ideal depth for the 58 millimeter uh, he was using so which means you are no longer need uh, the tempt the, the temping when you are making coffee so uh, I'm going to show, how, uh, show you guys how to adjust the, this leveler. so here's the leveler so first thing what what we have to do is we have to undo this just spin it out so you can actually dismantle it so the thing is we have to so so let's see it's gonna be counterclockwise you can uh, extend and the clockwise it's gonna be uh, to get smaller the gap here so here's the old way the key is we want to do the gap between this largest gap right there match that with the leveler. So I have a slightly gap. Okay, so again, so I have a slightly gap there. Actually, it's not too bad. I'm just going to make slight adjustment. Okay, something like that. So now I'm pretty much up oh, almost a little more. There we go. Now I'm pretty much right on it. So at this point, I'm going to put this uh, cap, put it back. and make sure tight let's go back here one more time just make sure we got the right depth yep we have we have the right depth okay we got the level ready to go so let's make some coffee so i have to make some choice should i use four four month old uh, espresso blend from Starbucks. I, mean, I think it's a, uh, they made for Costco. It smells really bad. Or I have my favorite uh, roaster, the Good Brothers Coffee. By the way, I'm going to put the, the uh, link below as well. I mean, these guys are pretty good. But this is uh, March 4th. That's the ro uh, roasted day. So it's been a long time since I've been sick for a while, so I haven't roasted any coffee beans yet. So but so about two months old could be four months old possibly i think i'm gonna go with the good brothers coffee smells are still smells still decent let's see here the profile on this we got the berry caramel and spice i can definitely uh smell the blueberry for sure 
And then let's see. So I'm gonna try this. So I'm gonna uh, get the 18 gram out, and I think I'm gonna use a niche for this one. Uh, great thing about the niche. So this is a zero retention grinder. So I put 18 gram in, uh, it's 18 gram out. So it's really nice to have that. Because especially using at home, it's not like I'm making like tons of coffee in the morning. So one dosing at a time is just perfect. Work. So now this is perfectly leveled. Again, if I'm gonna go like this, you can, you can see it, it's right on it. So this makes it a lot easier as well. The reason why, the reason why I like to use the, the temp, I just like to polish it to just top of it. There's nothing more, just polish it. And then oh, let's pull the shot here. Okay, so this wasn't the best shot. I mean, it was really too much pressure. I think it, the ground was too fine. But, hey, so I'm gonna try anyway. Cheers. Yeah, it's bitter. So what I need to do is I need to change my ground setting. Right now, I'm between, uh, let, let me show you here. Hopefully you guys can see it. Uh, I'm between uh, 20 and 30, so more like 25 on the ground setting, which means I need to be more coarser to get the right, uh, right shots because they come out slow, which means they're over extracting. So I gotta change that. Anyway, but overall, this leveler, I mean, this is great. I'm gonna put the link below as well. I think it's about 19 bucks, 19 to 20 dollars. And I mean, this is like knockoff from like OCD distribution tool, but this is good enough. And I mean, personally, I like it a lot. And then let's take a look at the puck. You know what? I mean, puck is nice and dry, you know, right depth as well. So I'm mean, just come right up. So, I mean, Overall, even though this bean is two months old, but still, still holding. So, I mean, I can't wait to try the, the fresh beans though. Anyway, I hope you guys like this video, and if you have any question or comment, please let me know, and please save out there, okay? See you guys next time.